Good morning, everyone. This is Apostle Deanna Dixon. I pray that you're having a blessed day. So I'm going to redo something. Oh, yeah, because I see how they do it. Y- y'all know this and y'all could. Uh, y- let me tell y'all something. They don't want y'all to know the secrets in this hour. They want to be the only one that have the secrets. We're talking about from the elite to every witch to every warlock. I'm pulling back the cover. Come on, somebody. I feel the anointing of God on me, in me, through me. And ain't nobody could stop it because you can't stop God. Come on, somebody. So I'm going to reiterate what I did. So praise God, praise God, hallelujah to his name. So anyway, Y'all I see was that talking line? about, that's a spider web. So, um, cause they chopped it up. They chopped it up real good. So now, just listen a little bit. Not that long. Y- y'all see how, but hold on. Look at the second one. Okay. I- I'm going to try to show you. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. So let's this see. is me. Y'all just, should, just hold on. I don't know if cause I'm redoing like this. That. The second one, hold on. I'm going to have to go closer. I'm going to have to go a little closer. Hold on. I'm trying to show y'all how it's okay. Y'all see, y'all see it. That's actually a spider. Have you ever seen a spider line like that? But anyway, long story short, this is that grapefruit tree. And so, you know what? I'm gonna go in here and I'm gonna show y'all. I gotta show y'all because this was crazy. I never saw this in my life. So I walked. So he said, "Go around." Y'all see down on the ground also these spider web things. When I say, look, look at it all in the yard i've never seen that like that look almost look like cat hair but it's not cat hair it's, i mean all around the yard i'm going here i'm going here i'm going here so point blank and i've never done it like this on purpose i'm going around the tree i'm showing y'all what i'm talking about they like little like this but y'all don't understand it wasn't just in one place it was literally around the house and god said you know, I, I'm, I don't have time to play with this thing because I want to I want to be an example, but I want to teach y'all what's really going on here. So y'all know I'm back in Louisiana. Point blank. I grew up here. Point blank. I grew up in here. I saw what they do. I know how they do it. They tried to teach me to do it, but I always rejected it. You know, as if I knew God was with me. Right. Come on, somebody. I'm saying it like I'm saying they can get mad if they want to. None but witches and warlocks because they don't trust God. OK, so. All right. So what happened is. I had went outside and I was doing a video and when I went to put it on YouTube is chopped up. I mean, they chopped up every important thing. So I'm reiterating it. So basically I'm going to reiterate the whole thing. I just want y'all to see the video that I did earlier. All right. So <laughs> this is so crazy. Um, y'all know I'm back in Louisiana. Y'all know what time it is. I'm going to reiterate everything I said. All right. Praise God. Praise God. I already know where I'm at. I grew up with witches. I grew up with raw locks. I, I I'm sorry. I gotta call it like it was on on my um on my dad's side. I saw some things. I didn't understand it at that time, but I understand now. And like I said, they tried to get me to can do to do it. But the little girl in me always knew God apparently because I always rejected it. I didn't want to know nothing about no witchcraft and how to keep a man and how to. I, I didn't want to know none of that stuff. Thank you, Jesus, and I thank God for him for him keeping me from it. Okay, so with that being said. After I did my video this morning, God said, Deanna, you're going to have to go around the house. And, and you know, I didn't know what to expect. I said, here we go. But, you know, I'm, I stay ready. Because to be honest with you, it been started. I've been here almost a week. The other day we woke up that morning and uh, it looked like somebody had dug a hole in the ground. And I already knew what time was. I said, Dad, you see, they said, yeah. I said, I got it. I went. I put the anointing all in the hole, around the hole, and I took the ammonia. Um, witches and warlocks, uh, hot, let me tell you something. That's stuff real. A lot of people used to say, if you don't believe in it, it's not real. I've seen things that I can't explain. I've seen people go crazy. I've seen people die. So don't tell me it's not real. But I'm not afraid of it. I've been training spiritual warfare for years. So I ain't scared of it. You got to understand what I'm saying. And they know it. Oh, y'all come on, somebody. Walk with me this morning. So anywho, um, I already know what I'm against. And I'm saying everything that I said in the video. Um, there have three women that basically was using my dad point blank for financial gain. But since I'm back, I guess they're mad. You know what I'm saying? So, and I, and I can care less. Y- y'all know what time it is with me. I'm a woman of God, but don't play with me. Hallelujah. That's my dad. And I can take it like that how you want to too. Hallelujah. So let's go here. So I already know that they do witchcraft. They do things. I'm already ready. I stay with God. Number one, I plead the blood of Jesus. So I ran around the house with them and I saw all these. I never saw nothing like this. They had little um, spider webs all over the yard. I never, I started taking a picture, but I, I was so busy spraying and, and I was like, oh my God, I'd never seen nothing like that. So that's what I was filming this morning. So they was chopping up 
my my life because you know they don't want y'all to know and this is what god was saying god says time out for witches and warlocks witches get stitches and i'm not talking about physically beating anyone i'm talking about body of christ it's time they think they run and stuff y'all know it's true look at all this stuff that's happening the elite think they run things witches and warlocks think they run things because right now the body of christ is weak you're not strong god says time for you to call those things as being not as though they are it is time for us to walk in our authority and i'm gonna say some things some hard things on here i was talking also about what my, one of my aunts told me and she did she was sitting in the car with me and um she said you powerful but i'm i'm more powerful too because i go to jamaicans and i get the root workers and i do this and i ain't going to lie to you i said get about my car before i do something in about five minutes because y'all know me i love the lord but with my past i'm not the one you want to test on no level i'm sorry i'm just he, hey he's a hey, i'm not jesus y'all know what time it is don't act like you don't know yes i love the lord i promise you i'm not trying to hurt nobody but don't bring that stuff here because i wasn't always saved baby hallelujah hallelujah yeah yeah y'all get it so anywho um they playing their games you know come around this house doing stuff and so I, i'm up on it i'm up on it that's one thing i know when i'm telling y'all i'm telling y'all this y'all can take it how you want to every place right now they're doing witchcraft it's not just louisiana Louisiana just a spider that's why I'm tripping about the spider webs oh lord God told me this when I was in California about Louisiana Louisiana this is where it started in New Orleans and it branches out to every other state now y'all don't have to believe me I really don't care I'm telling y'all what time it is it's heavy here so you, you you gotta be strong when you come here you ain't ready for me hallelujah hallelujah you have to be with God for real hallelujah these people don't play and that's not to um act like they're so powerful but witchcraft is real because that comes that power comes from the devil let me tell you why people do witchcraft they can't wait on god they so prideful they so greedy for this this that we're gonna go to the sue slayer god not god not answering enough god taking too long that's why people do witchcraft in the story point blank and they use it as manipulation they use it as a tool to try to hurt you but i'm gonna tell you what i said everything in that video Everything or anybody that tries to come in this yard against me and my father, I am sending it to the root of that thing. And then I'm sending it back to your household. But hold on. And not just touching you, your whole family. And, and I, I'm praying them prayers like David used to pray. Suffer not a witch to live. Kill them, God. Kill them. Yes, I said what I said. Y'all heard it right too. And I can show you scripture. So rebuke that if you want to. You can't rebuke scripture. The Bible says suffer not a witch to live. And he also means warlock too. Hallelujah. You want to play? Let's play for keeps. Nobody playing with y'all. Y'all sitting up there playing them games. Ain't nobody playing. And that's, that's what time it is. This is the last hour. The body of Christ have been scared to come against demons. Y'all know if they're not talking about it in the pulpit, they scared. You want to know why they scared of demons? Because most of them running the church are demons. Y'all ain't ready for me this morning. Y'all ain't ready. I've been on one. This conference coming up. I've been on one. I'm consecrated. I'm ready. Can't hear it in my voice. The anointing is on me. Hallelujah. I'm ready. Hallelujah. I feel the power of God. Hallelujah. It's time for us to stand up in this hour like never before. Point blank. If you read our ancestors, because that's who that is in that Bible, they were not jelly back. They weren't scared of demons. Instead of demons running them, they ran them demons. They did not play. Church, we got to have a standard in this hour. Quit being scared of demons. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. But now here's the thing. The reason why most of you scared of demons is because you're sleeping with demons. You're playing with demons. You're entertaining demons. So since you're playing with them, they're taking your strength anyway. Hallelujah. I, I, I'm not saying you have to be perfect in this hour, but you do have to be holy. Come on, somebody. God says prayer of the righteous at valid much. You got to be right. And they already know that because I'm going to tell you what that would say too when I left. And, and I caught it. I caught it when I was leaving. Guess what my aunt told me? She said, you know, when you leave, the power leave. Oh, so that so that's why y'all think y'all can mess with my daddy? Let me tell you something. God is God. And, and, and I, I'm giving y'all some key things. When you have an anointing, I pray for my whole family, even the ones that are not right. So any time you come against my family, you coming against me. But hold on, I have a covenant with God. You coming against God. Oh, y'all ain't ready. Right, let me let me walk this thing out. 
The Bible says that God is a covenant God. Because I have a covenant with God, he said, I'll be a friend to your friend and an enemy to your enemies. Or oh, I'm going to come back with word with you all the time. So don't ever think I'm just rambling. I've never been a rambler, baby. I know my scripture and I know my position and I know my covenant and I know my anointing. You better learn yours, God says. Hallelujah. Y'all stop letting these d- demons play with y'all. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. This stuff is real. Y'all stop letting them demons play with y'all. And I'm going here today. I'm going all the way out. I'm, I, since they messed up my life, I'm going all the way out. Y'all, when God told me to call my daddy a week and a half ago, my daddy was sick up in here for six days, not eating, dehydrated. I called my sister and I said, go see about my dad. She took him to the hospital. Dad was dehydrated. Dad was all kind of stuff. Let me tell you something. And I'm going here. Y'all ain't going to like this. And I really don't care. I know somebody fed my dad something. I know it. I'm a, I, oh, yes, that's why I came home, because that's my dad. I don't care about money. I don't care about Chef D.D. stuff. I don't care about none of that. That's my father. But more so, that's a man of God now. Dad wasn't always right, but that's a man of God. So you's messing with a man of God. Y'all ain't ready for me this morning. And now you're messing with a woman of God. Y'all ain't ready for me. Y'all ain't ready for me. Hallelujah. I know my authority. I walk in it. I talk in it. I live it. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The power of God is real. I've seen it. I feel it. I know it. He shows it. Y'all better understand who God is. God said, I am Jehovah Makedash. Hallelujah. Full of power. Come on, somebody. Do you know who God is? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm on one. I'm on one. I'm on one. They should have never started me, huh? I'm on one. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So I'm just saying right now, it's time out for all these games. Know your authority. Luke 10, 19, walk in your authority. God said, I've given you power, all power over the enemy. Y'all are giving the enemy too much ground. Shut witches down. Shut warlocks down. Shut demons down. Shut them down, said the Lord. Quit playing with them demons. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise God. I feel the power of God. So, yeah. Yeah, I'm on a different level because it's 2020 and God says that the church must reign in this hour. The remnant, where are you remnant? We're not scared. We don't run from stuff. We run to it. This what we doing. This what we doing. And let's do it. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. On every level too. Yeah, I say what I said. I say what I say. Y'all don't understand the power of God. That stuff real. God is real. I've seen God do things I can't explain. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So that's all I got to say. <laughs> Witches get stitches. <laughs> I'm on one. I'm on one. I'm sorry. I'm on one, y'all. Anywho, God bless y'all. God keep y'all. And be strong in the Lord in this hour. I'm telling y'all, y'all better be strong. You better get in your word. Touch not the unclean thing because they trying to tain us. They know if they tain us, you lose your power. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And I love that. Yes. Yes. Tamika Gomez. No one gets a pass. And I do. I, hold on. Family, friends, daughter, whoever. Y'all ain't ready for me. Y'all ain't ready for me. That's how it is. Hallelujah. I'm reminded of David's son, Absalom. Absalom come against David. What David men did him. He killed him. Then when David tried to cry, they said, hold on, hold on. That was your enemy. Y'all ain't ready for me this morning. That was your enemy. Yeah, I know it was a son of your loins, son from your blood, but that was your enemy. Y'all ain't ready for me. Who is your family who loves you and who, who obeys the laws of God? I say what I say. Hallelujah. So God bless you. God keep you. This is Apostle Deanna Dixon. Roll our soldiers for that is who we are. Don't forget it. You are a soldier of the army of the living God. Walk like it, talk like it, act like it, be like it, said God. Hallelujah. And shut them down. God bless.